how to create Gmail account without phone verification. I got a new trick on how to create a Gmail account that won't request for your phone number. But before we do anything first, let's go to Play Store. Let's go to Play Store. Now tap at the profile image. Now tap on the drop down arrow. It will display all the email you have created with your phone that is connected to your Play Store. Now we are going to remove all the email connected to our Play Store, but we will leave like one or two. Now scroll down, tap on manage account on this device. Now, the email, all the email that is connected on your phone, like I said, we are going to delete all, but we are leaving one or two. Now, let me assume I want to delete this email from my phone. Now, I will tap here. As you see, they said remove account. I can now tap on remove account. The reason we are taking this step first is to clear all the data that is being stored by Google Play Store about the number of Gmail we have already created using this phone. After removing the account, let's go back to our phone settings. Now go to Apps Management, go to App Settings. Now look for Google Play Store, look for Google Play Store. Tap on Google Play Store. Now tap on storage and cache. Now we are going to clear the cache and clear the storage. Now, so tap on cache and tap on clear storage. Now it says delete app data. All these apps data will be deleted permanently. This includes all files, settings, account databases now tap ok now let's go back let's go back to play store let's go back to play store let's go back to play store now at the search bar of play store, at the search bar of play store write opera mini opera mini opera mini now install this opera mini after installing this opera mini now go back to your phone settings go back to your phone settings now look for apps management now tap on default app now tap on browser app now as you can see my Opera Mini is my default browser app. Now, if Opera Mini is not your default browser app, please make sure it is checked so you can make it your, your default browser app. Now, after you've made it your default browser app, go back, go back. Now, the next thing is to go back to Play Store. Go back to Play Store. Now tap on the profile image, tap on this drop down arrow. Now tap on add another account, tap on add another account. It's processing, let it process. After it's done processing, it will bring you here. Now please, before I continue, Make sure you follow my step from step A to step Z. If you miss anything, you won't get it and you will start to complain. Now, the next thing is to tap on the create account. Now, tap for myself. Tap for myself and let it process. Now, first name. First name. Now, last name is optional, but let me just write it. Last name is optional. Now, tap on next, the next option, the next button. Tap it. Now, let's just put any day, any month. Let's just type any. Now, gender, definitely, I'm a male. 
Now the next thing is to tap next. Now Gmail has created email for us, but we can choose to create our own Gmail. But if I should advise you, I will tell you to tap on the email Gmail has created for you. Now let's tap on the first one. Now tap on next. Now password, password, password. Now tap on next. Now they said add phone number. They said add phone number. Now this is the point people always complain about. But if you follow my instruction from step A, to step Z, you will have no complaint cause you will get it right. Somebody accused me that I am using a different phone. But, but I am not using any phone again. Now this is the only phone I have. This is the only phone I have. And if you observe, you observe that this is the phone I have been using to teach you how to create unlimited Gmail account. I have created over 1000 more than, I am not lying. I create Gmail account every day, every day with this phone. Yes, I do create Gmail account because I do, that is, my job always require I use email. So I do create Gmail account. I've created more, more Gmail account with this one phone. So if you follow my step, there's no way you will not get it right. Uh, somebody said that if you create like five Gmail accounts, that if you want to create again, it will ask you for phone number. Yes, it is true. But if it asks you for phone number, follow my step again from step A to step Z. At this point, it won't ask you for a phone number. The option would be compulsory. Now, if you now scroll down, if you now scroll down, as you can see, I can skip phone number. I can determine to add phone number. If I want to add, I tap on yes, I am in. But if I want to skip, I tap on skip. Now, let it load. Now, at this junction, I will now tap on next. Scroll down. Now, they said privacy and terms. So you have to read all or let's say go through all these privacy and terms if you agree then tap on i agree now let it load so the email finally has been created as you can see this is the email so go and confirm it now please for the first person that need this email as you all know i did not hide the password you can change the password and make this email yours Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. One love everybody. Obrigado.